This is a patient who came with right upper quadrant pain and fever, has got a CAT scan showing an indeterminate liver mass, and an MRI was uh, suggested for further evaluation. So here's a T2-weighted fat-saturated sequence in the axial plane. You can scroll through these images focusing on the liver. You can maybe start to notice some subtle hyperintense signal within the posterior right hepatic lobe. As we go more inferiorly, right at the tip of that right hepatic lobe, we can see that there is this T2 hyperintense mass with ill-defined borders, and that was the indeterminate mass that we saw on the prior CAT scan. And this is what it looks like on the T2-weighted sequences. When we give intravenous contrast, we can see that uh, this demonstrates rim enhancement. We have a few uh, thin internal septations, certainly no solid components. Given the history of fever and right upper quadrant pain, this is a great look for hepatic abscess. In addition, we also notice if we look at the hepatic vasculature that there's this branching region of non-enhancement in the posterior right hepatic lobe right over there. And it uh, goes out. And if we scroll back upwards, we can see that it goes right into the right hepatic vein. So that's a branch of the right hepatic vein that is thrombosed. And so in this case, we have an hepatic abscess with associated uh, branch thrombosis of the right hepatic vein.